Yo, what is up? What is going on guys? Zach or Mortal Resistance here and welcome to a more a more serious video here on my channel. It's not too often that you guys get to see videos like this from me or see this side of me because it's not really what I focus my channel around in all honesty. Um, and that's kind of an ironic statement at this current point in time because I'm actually at the time of recording this, um, I'm going to be making a few videos that are in vlog format here uh, compared to my normal like gameplay commentary stuff like that. Uh, so in before comments in future videos saying Zach you're wearing the same clothes as you were in that one video no I own more than this, just this shirt I promise they're they're in that closet that, that big white door there's clothes in there can confirm uh, but anyways uh, what I'm gonna be talking about today guys is why I left doom some of you guys may be hearing this for the first time some of you guys may be hearing this for um, a second or third time if you guys follow me on Twitter I announced the other day that uh, yes indeed my time with the doom clan has uh, has ended and it's a bittersweet thing um, I've been in Doom for 20 months, right? 20 months ago, I joined Doom, thanks to, uh, to K-Slice. Some of you guys may know him, some of you guys may not. He was the one who, uh, talked to Coldside or Taylor, uh, about me joining Doom. And to this day, I still have the unlisted video of my first ever Doom video, um, with one of Never's gameplay, Never That Kid's gameplays. It's like a DSR double nuclear or something from Black Ops 2. I still have this saved on my hard drive because of that, that, that was such a huge thing for me. Uh, my channel over like the, before entering doom my channel was not growing insanely fast I just enjoyed doing YouTube because I I liked making even just if it was one person smile I just love making people smile and making people laugh and entertaining people I've always been like into that sort of thing um, and doom really really gave me a much bigger opportunity and a much bigger space to be able to do that um, which I am so incredibly grateful for but there, there comes a time where you need to change. So if you guys don't know, uh, for the past, I want to say, month and a half, month or so, uh, I've actually been a co-leader of Doom. Uh, I co-led co it alongside Garge and Coldside. Garge was away in basic training, which uh, is mandatory for every uh, Finnish citizen. So I was, uh, I was in charge of uploading, making sure commentaries were getting done, making sure specific gameplays were getting done, um, and stuff like that. And I enjoyed it. I was in, I'm incredibly grateful for the position that I had in Doom, and I feel like I, I made an impact on the channel. I wanted to leave the biggest mark I could while I had a position in leadership. Uh, but there comes a time where it's just you need you need to change something up, and that's what I feel like uh, it's time for here with Doom. So I am no longer a part of Doom. Uh, I'm not sure if I'm going to join a different clan or anything like that. But uh, my time in Doom it's over. Unfortunately, uh, you know it's it's like I said it's bittersweet. Um, it moves me into new positions for the future you know onwards and upwards from here is the way that I like to look at it but at the same time uh, 20 months you really get to know people and some of my best friends that I met here on YouTube are, are in Doom or I met because of Doom or I've met like people that uh, people that I never thought I would associate myself with through being in Doom like I know some of these people like um, Jay Nasty for instance he was one of the very first YouTubers I watched when I started uh, when I started this YouTube channel and through doom and through making friends here on YouTube like I, I get to talk to him I've been in Skype calls with him like we ch we chilled on and Call of Duty and stuff like I've get I've gotten to meet some people that I like looked up to at times um, and I can now consider them friends which is just mind-blowing to me um, that I was able to do that just from you know saying hey would you want to make a video with me on some random YouTube video from some guy that I liked and it turned out like he wanted to collaborate and we were we uh, became friends and he knew someone in doom and he got into doom and then he got me into like it's it's such a crazy thing to think about and I'm so I'm so grateful for the opportunity that I had over the last 20 months um, but it was just time to move on you know and I don't really I don't have beef with anyone in doom I don't have any bad blood I love every single member of doom they're all awesome um, I have some projects going on with a few of them actually that I'm really excited to talk about in the future uh, but I just I just needed to move on uh, I felt like it was in a good position uh, with the members that doom currently has I feel like the channel is completely capable of doing just as well without me in the clan um, without me managing uploads and stuff like that so I figured it, uh, it was a good time for me to move on and uh, hopefully you guys will stick with me through this I know a lot of you came over from doom there's no way there's no chance on earth in a million lives 
that I would be uh, at, the, at the size I am right now in terms of subscribers if it weren't for Doom. I would easily, I have to give Doom at least like, I don't know, we're almost to 8,000 subscribers. Doom's probably uh, helped with about three or 4,000 of those because of uh, how, how big we've gotten to uh, grow the Doom brand, which is, uh, I'm, I'm incredibly proud to be a part of that. You know, the first channel hit 100,000 subscribers. We were actually probably upwards of like 110,000 subscribers when that got shut down. And that was a time where it's like, you, you got to find the, um, the real story behind a lot of people because those people who are just in it to grow their channel because just because they wanted to have uh, internet fame, those people were the ones who skipped out on Doom the second the channel got closed. And uh, the people who, stu who stuck through that and stayed around and tried to rebuild the channel, the second channel, which is now over 50,000 subscribers, uh, those, those people are the real awesome, like those people are the real MVPs in all honesty. And I am incredibly happy and incredibly proud to be calling those guys friends and to have worked with them over like the past 20 months. Like I said, I've met some crazy people, like I, I have such, so many good friends now because of Doom and Garge and Coldside are amazing leaders, they're two of the coolest guys I've ever met and I'm uh, very very happy to call them friends. But um, yeah, that's that's pretty much the reason why I left Doom. It was just time for a change. I needed to move on and uh, onwards and upwards from here, guys. So I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Hopefully I cleared up any questions you guys had about this. Um, and I will catch you guys next time. As always, have an awesome rest of your day. Stay happy, stay positive, and I'll see you guys later. Peace out. Bang, bang. 420 yellow blaze at scopes. Okay.